So, this is actually quite recent. About four months ago, to be exact. I, a 22-year-old male, was waiting for my turn at the clinic with my mother. We were supposed to be the next in line to go in after the patient that was already with the doctor at the time. However, that person was there for so long, almost two full hours to be exact, that's when I just had this weird feeling that something bad might happen. While we were still waiting outside, all of a sudden, a teenage girl walked in with her mother who was coughing up blood and looked to be in really bad shape. Couldn't walk on her own, bloodshot eyes, bruises all over her body. The girl then asked us, there were like three middle-aged women in there, and old men in addition to me and my mom, if someone could help her mom. One of the other women that was there waiting for us explained to her that this isn't a hospital and that the clinic doesn't have the proper equipment to help her. Then someone else told her that there's a hospital nearby with emergency services and gave her its name and location. We then quickly started gathering some money for her before they went. All the while, the mom was still bleeding on the couch near us. Once I tried handling her, handing her the money, her mom, who didn't speak a word until then, pointed at me and screamed with the, all the blood coming out of her mouth. It really spooked me for some reason. It sounded like one of those animal screams that you hear when an animal gets severely hurt. Once the girl had collected enough money, I then asked her who told her to come here in the first place. She said, the janitor, the short man by building's entrance, which was super weird since the janitor that we just passed by before, the elevator and went into the doctor's office was a strikingly tall man. And he's always the only one there. But of course, I didn't think of that then. Anyways, she got the money and was leaving with her mother. I tried helping the girl, but as soon as the mother saw me, she started screaming her lungs out again. This time she was crying as well while still pointing at me. The girl asked the old man to help her get her mom downstairs instead. At that point, the patient that was with the doctor had finally got out. I immediately went in. Just about 15 minutes when I was with the doctor, we heard that agonizing scream again. I was super still creeped out from what happened before, but I brushed it off. When I was done with the doctor, I got out of the room and asked one of the women that were waiting there what that scream was and why did they come back again. She said, they came back shortly after when they couldn't find a taxi outside. Then she said, the poor woman was shouting nonsense when I said like what? She said, she said something along the lines of, where is he? Why is he hiding from me? Again, there were only two males in there. I was in the doctor's office while the old man was still outside. Then the old man went out with them and got them a taxi. When I discussed that with my mother, when we got home, she suspected that it was all a hoax by the girl and her mother to scam people for charity. I still don't know for sure if that was the case or not to this day. But that woman's look and scream while pointing at me 
still gives me the creeps to this day. <laughs>